And now I'd like the uh, the next two people that we're going, going to uh, recognize have, a, have come up and say a, say a couple of words. These folks work tirelessly on behalf of St. Louis Center to make it what it is right now, what it, what it has been, what it will be in the future. The first person I'd like to call up is Mr. Larry Dowell, who's the chair of the Community Advisor, Advisory Committee and uh, does a wonderful job helping to steer this committee and St. Louis Center in a great direction. Larry? Thank you very much, Joe. And thank you everyone for coming out today. The, the Community Advisory Council you know, meets every month and we, we pour over a lot of different details. And you know, of course, one of the key things we look at is the financial stability of the St. Louis Center. And when looking at this project, we uh, thought, well, Father Gwinnella Hall would be a perfect uh, location for a, a program to service the the aging of persons with developmental disabilities, but how are we going to pay for it? <laughs> and, um, you know, I guess it's kind of like the, uh, the the old movie, Build It and They Will Come. Well, Build It, They Will Come, and we'll find the money. And uh, you people out here are all a uh, an answer to that and to the prayers that we've had for that. So I'd like to specifically thank all of the members of the Community Advisory Council that are here today, um, our general contractor, Mr. Andy Schmina, my vice chair, uh, Julie Ballou, uh, Nancy Grabner, uh, Dr. Donna Rosnick, uh, George Mallison, Kathy Newman, and uh, along with his brothers from the uh, Brooklyn Knights of Columbus, they ushered us in very well with our car parking, Mr. Joe Zilke. And I don't think I, I think I caught everybody that's here. And uh, just one other thing I'd like to thank, uh, you know, the members of the staff here at St. Louis Center. Father Lorenzo, uh, Peggy Cole, uh, Joey Akulis, the former uh, finance director, Mr. Steve Doubt, who was very instrumental in the uh, project here at, this, uh, at the Father Gwinnell Hall, and the new finance director, Mr. Mike Kudis. These, these people also attend those meetings every month and, and help us steer the way uh, and, and Muddle, uh, help us work through all of the, uh, the things that we don't fully understand about running a facility like this. So with that, I thank you all for coming and I'll turn it back over to you, Joe.